Okay, so last month I actually showed you how to construct your own home arcade cabinet. So, as promised, this month I'm going to bring you how to set up your hardware and software. So why don't we go ahead and turn this bad boy around and crack it open. Okay, so now that we've got the case all opened up and the hardware laid out, let's go ahead and start off with the core of this whole thing, and that's a Celeron 400 with passive cooling. The passive cooling saves us space with the lack of a fan, and for that same reason, it keeps the noise down. Next, we have a Rage 128 Pro integrated, and between the two, we have more than enough system resources to do what we want to do. Now, over here, we've got an IBM 7 gig mounted, and that's plenty of storage space. IDE cable. Now it would be rounded, but some jackass keeps interrupting me when I try to make them. <coughs> Darn! Oh, mm. excuse me. Over here, our controllers plug into a USB hub and over here to the USB ports. The other ports being used by our USB powered speakers because no cab would be complete if you didn't have sound. We have a 90 watt power supply powering the whole thing, and over here, both our monitor and power supply are plugged in plugged into a power strip, excuse me, which comes out through a hole in the back so we only have one cord hanging out. Let's go ahead and turn it around and check out the software end. Okay, so now we're all booted in and uh, we're running MAME32 as our front end for our MAME emulator. Now granted, front ends for MAME are like distributions for Linux. There's a ton of different kinds, so just pick the type that best suits you. What we like about MAME32 is that there's an option that we can scroll through the games with the joysticks instead of having to use a keyboard. Now one joystick will do single selection, one up, one down. The other joystick will do an entire page. So, like I said, we're running MAME32 as our front end and Windows XP is our operating system. And it just, it runs very smoothly, no problems. All you have to do is select a game you want to play. Uh, what's, what, what's a good one, Darren? Joust, go up one. Joust? Page up one. There you go. All right, so we'll load up that one. Okay, so as always, links for all the pertinent information will be in the show notes. So other than that, it's time for me to get my arcade micro on. Y'all take it easy. Come on, Darren, get owned. Please.